At SeaTech Japan 2010, NICT displayed a prototype multi-sensory interaction system, creating a natural and realistic way to interact with virtual objects. The object on display is called Gin Kunro. It is a sensor or incense burner and was made in Japan during the Nara period in the 8th century for scenting clothing. This system integrates um, visual, haptic, auditory and uh, olfactory information to provide people a feel that an object is just in front of you. So you can see it, touch it, hear the sound when you're touching it, also you can smell. The interaction system is made up of four main parts. The 3D imaging device, which allows the object to be seen in 3D. The haptic device, developed by American company Sensible, which allows the object to be touched. The contact sound generator and the micro aroma shooter. The contact sound device generates sound depending on where and how the user applies pressure to a specific point. The sound is generated by the uh, real-time calculation. So we get, we sample the sound from real objects and extract the frequency, damping, amplitude damp parameters. Then when you touch, in, touch this object, the force is used to generate the sound, calculate it real-time. Actually, if it's not, um, it's a different object, say, drum, when you're tapping it, or scratching it, the sound will be totally different. So we developed an algorithm to generate sound smoothly transition uh, up between these two kinds of sounds. So you, you feel uh, the reality is much higher with the contact sound. The micro aroma shooter releases aromas directly to the user's nose without the smell spreading out. We cannot give detailed information about the um, olfactory device because uh, we are applying patent for that. So we can only say we make a very small, short, shorter, aroma shorter. So it's only this size, like a little cube. And we can generate, uh, we can control the timing at the time, how long it's generated. So you can smell it at the moment you want it. The system has previously been used in a digital museum setting to display artifacts which cannot normally be touched. And NICT is considering other future applications, such as advanced medical diagnosis training and surgical simulations, product design, and for interacting with products in an online environment. Digging for news.